It's this time of year I'm reminded that after a tripod and a shutter release, a circular polarizer is your best friend. Especially when photographing things like trees and anything else having to do with the sky, including things like the sky. The sky's blown out a lot. As you can see in this photo here, it's got a whitish hue to it. Sunlight is polarized. That's atmospheric physics I won't go into now. But what a circular polarizer does is filter some of those out. And what I'm going to do is, it's, this is on front of uh, my lens. I'm doing nothing except for turning this polarizer until simply watch the sky. There we go. Now look at that. Much nicer. Sky much bluer and more importantly much darker. That way we don't have so much contrast between the trees and the sky. You see much more detail in those trees. Let me show you it again without the filter or the filter rotated such that it's letting in all of the sunlight, just about all, and now rotating it and again watch those trees and watch that sky and you'll even notice a marked difference in even some of the coloring of the trees. There we go. Polarized. Wonderful. You want to get a circular polarizer.